The burning of fossil fuels in cement production release more than 9 gigatons of carbon per year. The world oceans take up about one quarter of the human-made CO2 emissions from the air. The deep oceans store about six times more carbon dioxide than the atmosphere. Consequently, the ocean is a critical factor damping the effect of the human-made CO2 emission, which is the primary cause of climate change. Uh, so, like Researchers across uh, Europe have joined forces in the Ocean Thematic Center, located at the Bjorkne Center for Climate Research in Bergen. Here they try to get a better understanding of the complex interplay between oceans and the atmosphere. The oceans are important for storing CO2. In order to understand the present state and predict the future behavior of the carbon cycle, we need to have a long-term monitoring of the ocean. The Ocean Thematic Center currently coordinates 21 stations that monitor carbon uptake in the North Atlantic, the Baltic, and the Mediterranean Sea. Measurements are performed on a variety of platforms, including moorings and commercial vessels that have been equipped with state-of-the-art carbonate system sensors, as well as sampling from research vessels. Back in Bergen, the collected water samples are analyzed for CO2 and salt concentrations. It's an important task for the Ocean Thematic Center to develop the best practice guidelines and protocols to ensure high quality ocean data. Scientists will feed these data into advanced computer models that will calculate CO2 emissions across Europe. The Carbon Portal is a one-stop shop for this data. The Ocean Thematic Center is part of a larger European infrastructure network called the Integrated Carbon Observation System. The objective is to measure and assess atmospheric greenhouse gas concentrations. This requires observations from atmospheric, terrestrial, and ocean stations. We try to ensure high quality measurement that are independent and reliable. The monitoring system will support government in their efforts to cut their CO2 emission as well holding them accountable for reaching the two degree target.